your mom's calling. She only ever calls me about Chris, Joey, or Melissa, so should I pick up? Screw it. Just pick it up and let me know what she says. All right. Hello? Hi, Miranda. How are you? I'm doing good. What's up? I still want Joey to sign me over legal guardianship and custody of Chris. But until then, I'm not going to be selfish. I can take Chris off your hands for a little bit so that you and Joey can have some free time. And then I'll, I'll give him back to you both. You want to take Chris, not permanently, but you want to take Chris off my hands for a bit. Yeah, you know, he is my grandson and I do miss him and I'm never allowed to see my other grandson. So, yeah, I would love to take him off your hands for a while. Yeah, um, just hold on for one second. You heard that? Tell her no. Because your main priority right now is to get Chris to Melissa's family, his other family. Once that baby is there, it'll be there forever. Once you give it to her, it's gonna come back to this house and it's gonna be in Joey's arms again. So no. All right, but when I, it's gonna be weird if I say no because I've been wanting to get Chris out of the house forever. So what, do I, what am I telling her? Tell her the truth. Tell her that you're, you have people that wanna take Chris and you think they're a good fit. You don't need to be shy. All right. Hi, Mel. Yes. Yeah, so I'm gonna cut to the chase. It seems kind of close that me and Joey are gonna find someone to take Chris. So at this time, since everything's up in the air, um, we'll just keep him here. And, and what family members are willing to take this baby? Yeah, so I've been in talks with Melissa's cousin, Julia, and Joey's been in talks with her father to take the baby. And um, we're pretty close on both ends. We just have to make a decision. So right now, I. I thought I already made it clear that me and Melissa don't want Chris going to her family. Melissa especially. You don't know anything about them. And I don't think it would be wise to give the baby to them. That's not what we want. I know what you both want. Um, but I think that Chris is better off going to one of her extended family members right now. Because Joey, we don't... I don't want Chris in this house anymore. Not gonna lie. I don't want Chris in this house anymore, and if we give him to you, the likelihood is he's coming back to this house. You know, you really shouldn't have a say with any of this. You have no relation to that child. And what is Melissa supposed to do when she gets out of this rehab and that baby is halfway across the country? You don't see anything wrong with that. If Melissa wants to go get Chris from her family members, I can't stop her. But right now, um, why do you want to take Chris temporarily? Why do you want to take him off my hands when you've never done a favor for me in my entire life? I have my reasons. And it, again, it's my, my grandson, and I want to see my grandson. You're not going to stop me from seeing this one. Okay, you have yours, and I already allowed you to restrict me from seeing him. But this one is not yours. Well, um... I can't believe I'm saying this, but Chris is staying with me, and um, I don't know what to tell you. Wow. It's actually not that hard to just stand up for myself. I'm proud of you. You know, my mom doesn't have any power in this situation. She's just a grandmother, and you're the wife of the baby daddy. If anyone has, like, a little bit of say, it's you. So stand up for yourself. At this point, I am really going to push for... Julia to get Chris. I just get this, this great vibe from her. And if this baby has to be in anyone's home, she just sounds like she wants it. You know, she wants to be a parent. Well, I have no idea what it's like to really want to have kids like that, but um, I have your back. Like, I'll help you fight and I'll help you get Chris to her if you need help. Thank you. You always have my back. I appreciate it. I, I'm going to have a normal life. I'm going to get this baby a home and let Melissa fight from now on. Let her be the one digging through the mud to get everything normal. 